thank you for introduction and thank you PAF for invitation. So I will give you some facts about Svenska Spel and facts about the Swedish gaming market and especially about our platform for responsible gaming in, Swe in English, keep track on your gaming. So start with the Svenska Spel. Uh, we are 100% owned by the Swedish state and we are 1,700 employees including uh, the casino operations. 43% market, uh, 43 market share and our earnings are 4. billion Swedish crowns and operated margin 22%. We have 5 million customers, uh, where of the half, 2.5 million has the customer card. 7,500 retailers and business partners. Business partners is actually uh, the restaurant that has our VLTs. Six different sales channels, um, you have land-based and online casinos, uh, online um, uh, operation, uh, mobile, VLT, casino, so totally six sales channels and four casinos. So the Swedish gaming market has increased uh, three percentage each year since 2003. But last year we had a drop of one percentage. So the total gaming market is 20 billion Swedish crowns. And as I said, we had, uh, Svenska Spel has 43%. The horse company, 18. Postcode, lottery, and geos had 19. And offshore companies is actually the companies that have no license to operate in Sweden. They have 20 of the market. And we can see we have an escalating war in the media, uh, especially referring to the three uh, latest years. Uh, especially from 2013 to 2014, we had an increase of nearly 70%. In total, 3.6 billion Swedish crowns. And 72% of this was actually invested by the offshore companies. So it's really a tough competition in Sweden. So in that sense, we have to be different. We have to uh, differentiate us. So we have made huge change uh, on the responsibility side. Um, for example, in 2013, we took away, we removed all our bonuses and discounts. In 2014, last year, we introduced mandatory registration for all gaming, except for uh, casino, um, land-based casino. I think it's really fantastic, and it's, it's something I'm really proud of, all the initiatives that we have done. It's a matter of turning towards a more sound and, and, um, and um, responsible uh, development. It's all about the responsibility. Of course, we will focus on our revenue, and of course, we will be commercial, but it has, been, uh, has to be in a sound way. We have gone from a strong focus on sales to a distinct focus on responsibility. So we will continue on this way. And we want to have responsibility before profit. We want to fulfill our promise. Everyone should enjoy to, to gaming at, at Svenska Spel. So this is actually the, the starting page on, on svenskaspel.se. It's just one click away. We had that spell call. It's keep track on you gaming. So in one click away, you will get this um, collected uh, web page for all our responsible gaming initiatives. Uh, for example, uh, we have my gaming habits, uh, mandatory weekly budget, information how to, to get in contact with the national public helpline. And we have uh, pre-commitments for, for VLTs and for poker in time and money. 
and gaming history, you can see all the winnings and losses. And you have a self-exclusion, take a break from the gaming, and information about responsible gaming for players, uh, for relatives, for employees. So I will shortly describe <coughs> three of these boxes. My gaming habits. In April, we launched a play scan for all. It's mandatory for all. Do you know what play scan is? Do you know what play scan is? <laughs> Great. It's actually a tool to, to track the behavior of gambling. We can now follow our customers' behavior and the people and the players can keep track on the gaming habits. If you play in a way that could lead to problems, you get a warning about the increased risk. Green means that you seem to have a good check on your gaming. And yellow, orange, red, you're starting to get the risk behavior. You can get a, an, an information how to play in a responsible way. You can get some tips when you have come to that page. Recently, we had an evaluation done by Dr. Richard Wood, and he confirmed the effect of the tool. It actually had an effect of at-risk players, that they actually reduced the risk of, of um, gambling. And so far, we have had 250,000 visitors on internet, on our mobile, that has actually visited the play scan, so they know how, what it is. You can also have your self-test done in the gaming habits to find out if you have a risky behavior. And so far this year, we have had 50,000 self-tests. Gaming history, here you can see all your winnings uh, and losses at the very same time and uh, how much you have spent. Here's a, actually an overview of my gaming. I'm not a frequent player, as you can see. It's an overview how much I have been uh, gambled for from September last year to September this year. Uh, I have lost 300 crores, so I'm, I'm not a, a frequent player. You could also choose if you want to have an overview of only poker or only uh, VLTs. Uh, here, I haven't been playing poker for one year here. If I had done that, it would be have the same um, graph that I have winnings and losses, and you would have a graph of how much time I have spent on poker. The next initiative is take a break or self-exclusion. Here you can choose to take a break from all our games or just poker or Vegas. And you can choose if you want to exclude you for three months, six months, one year or three years. If you choose one to three years, you always have to have a follow-up call by our customer support that are trained in uh, motivated interviews. And this year we also launched a, a new feature to have a 24-hour break, or a panic button, top right. You just push the button, and then you will be excluded for 24 hours for all our quick games, scratch tickets, uh, online bingo, and some number games. So we have asked uh, 1,000 persons between 18 and 75 years. Who do you think is the leader when it comes to responsible gaming in Sweden? About 50 to 55 percent thinks that Svenska Spel is the leader when it comes to responsible gaming. It's a huge gap to the nearest operator, three percentage. But it's worrying that still there are 25 percent that doesn't know and 14% think 
none of or all of operators in Sweden is leading when it comes to responsible gaming. So when we launch um, this responsible gaming platform, uh, we would like to, to, to tell it to our customers. It's always difficult how to communicate responsible gaming because uh, it's no effect in, 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 in the communication field. So we did actually this um, uh, film. Uh, it's, it's about more uh, moments uh, when it's regarding to sports and um, moments when it's uh, TV draws for the scratch tickets and the number games. It's, um, so it's a short film. I just click here. No. You must help me <laughs> what to do. Det är nu du håller andan. Det där är Kim Kjellström. Och det känns som läge för en vänsterfot. Nu spärras dina ögon. Ja, den är bra för en högerfot också. Det är nu din puls ökar. Det är Kim som kliver fram här. Som skjuter! Det är bra! Först börjar plocka. Han har mycket is framför sig. Nu behöver du bero. Och nu skriker du. Och ser en chans att ta den. Bra nu, det kommer in på läget. Ja! Ja, jag tror ni fattar. Så so the payoff is actually we keep track on the excitement and you keep track on your gaming. Carry on having fun. Thank you.